Each year, students hold an exhibition for family and friends to show all the science experiments and projects they've worked on. The exhibition you're about to view shows the fourth grade's work on astronomy. For this unit, we transformed the science lab into a solar system travel agency. Students' assignment was to convince Earthlings to try a great vacation getaway, far away, like maybe on Jupiter or Mars. Each planet had its own station in the lab. Kids then demonstrated experiments and explained what they had learned to potential tourists. They get to be the experts and teach about what they've learned. It's a perfect way to demonstrate their learning and a great opportunity to see education in action. Let's take a look. We're making these bags with um, paint to show the rings and zones and belts around Jupiter. In this experiment, we are showing Jupiter's cloud bands and how they separate into different colored zones and belts. This student is demonstrating the relationship between reflected light and the phases of the moon. I did um, five fun facts about Mercury. Mercury can range from temperatures of 300, negative 300 degrees Fahrenheit to 800 degrees Fahrenheit. Neptune is the smallest gas planet. Mars is rusted and red well, because there was water. There's evidence of water. Yeah. In, in Mars, there's iron under the ground, which makes it red. This is the sun. This is Mercury. This is Venus. This is Earth. So it takes, this is the, where the rocket ship takes off. And then this is Mars, and then this is Jupiter, and this is the asteroid belt. And Earth has a magnetic field. So, I'm going to show you what a magnetic field looks like. Looks like, even though you can't see one, you, you can actually see them if you do this. Look, watch. You see the lines? Yeah. That is a magnetic field. So, and that's what is around our Earth. And you see how they're strongest here? Yeah, stronger there and there. Yeah, it's because what happens is, at the top of our Earth and the bottom of our Earth are the North and South Poles. And the wind, I mean, the sun gives off solar wind, which hits the north and south poles and creates the northern and southern lights. Thanks for visiting our solar system travel agency. We hope your next trip is out of this world.